Tonight, the nation's top doctor is recommending new boosters for the Omicron variant. But Florida's Surgeon General is recommending that some men not get the mRNA COVID vaccine. Some medical experts are rejecting this new guidance. They tell 10 Tampa Bay's Miguel Octavio that getting sick or dying from COVID is much more likely than what the state suggests. I was absolutely gobsmacked. I could not believe that he would make such an irresponsible um, recommendation. Epidemiologists across the country are, are, are really just scratching their heads. And it's that lack of balance, the ability to weigh the risks versus the benefits that I was missing from this report. All scientists we spoke with say Dr. Joseph Latipo's guidance lacked evidence. There are several major issues with the study. This past Friday, the state surgeon general recommended men ages 18 to 39 not take the mRNA COVID vaccines. That includes Pfizer and Moderna. The state's analysis claims there are more risk cardiac related deaths in this age group within 28 days after they took the vaccine. I have zero problem with the investigation of risk and actually it's not even the first study. Dr. Jason Salemi notes nothing comes with zero risk. But the science shows the rewards preventing sickness or dying from COVID still outweigh the risks, even in this age group. There were 20 deaths that happened within 28 days and then 77 deaths overall in this particular subgroup. And during that same period of time, there was more than 940 COVID deaths. And so the lack of evidence for what is the risk of infection and how good are the vaccines at lowering those risks, that's what I would have wanted to see. Miguel Octavio, 10 Tampa Bay. And of course, it's always a good idea to have a discussion with your doctor about what is best for you. Miguel did ask the state health department to respond to this criticism that this new guidance is getting. We're going to let you know when we hear back on that.